Hey guys, it's Greg from Vanguard Motor Sales. Man, I got a cool one for you today. I got a 2022 GT500 Heritage Carbon Fiber Edition. This baby's only got 386 miles on it right now. 760 horsepower under the hood. Seven speed dual clutch transmission and talk about a blast. Now I know quite a bit about driving one of these. I can't say I know everything about the instrumentation about it because it just does a million things but the thing drives like a dream i've actually got the pleasure of driving one quite a few miles and we've had just a blast with it um, they are just incredible cars fast as grease lightning 3.6 0 to 60 uh, sub 11 times i've seen everything from 10 6 to 10 8 in a quarter mile and let me tell you, I drove mine on the expressway quite a bit, and you want to talk about getting out of its own way, I tell you, I pass more people in this car than you can shake a stick at. Look at this thing, absolutely beautiful, man. And one of the coolest things are, you can make this a daily driver, and I did. I put about 40,000 miles on two different cars, and just having a blast. I mean, we took it to the grocery store. We had, we even put our German Shepherd in the back seat. Of course, mine wasn't the carbon fiber edition that did have the back seat, but this would even be better to haul your dog around because we don't have a back seat in it. Tell you what, nothing cuter than a German Shepherd in the GT500, man. Of course, we got the big carbon fiber wing on the back. Then the Heritage Edition is super cool. They didn't make very many of these. And then this is the painted stripe car also. Um, she's just absolutely gorgeous. Like the uh, 1967 GT500 of the same color, this Brittany blue, looking sweet. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do consignment whatsoever. That means we own this GT500. So, you know, we've checked it out. And uh, it's here in the showroom, and Tom can tell you all about it when you call him at 248-974-9513. favorite car now GT500 baby and I know I've said it so many times but everybody knows I've been driving one of these for a while and I just absolutely love them now we're gonna fire this thing up so you can see the screens and that so you've got the screen here that controls everything it's gonna pop on here in a second your radio and your modes and all that good stuff um, come up on the screen there which is super cool with the uh, Cobra on there but then if you get over here to the dash uh, you can change your driving mode and it actually changes the dash too. So there's normal mode, there's sport mode, then here, uh, oh there, see how the dash changed. Then when you go to track mode, it changes again. And then you can actually customize all that. Like, I, I even though I've put like 40,000 miles of seat time on a couple of these, I don't know how to work every one of the controls. You've got launch control, you've got, um, uh, trans brake or I should say uh, you've got the uh, line lock I mean it's just it's got all kinds of stuff going on here man you got to be like a New York City lawyer to figure out how to work everything on this thing but there are a lot of YouTube videos and that out there um, so you can uh, learn how to do everything uh, the radio controls are on the on the steering wheel you can change the uh, steering you can change the shocks uh, you know how stiff the steering are is how stiff the shocks are I mean this thing will do anything and then the paddle shifters are cool one of the things I like like when you're going down the road you can squeeze both of these and it actually puts the car in neutral if you want to rev it up and impress your buddies down on the side or like when you're in traffic and you want to downshift if you hold down the down paddle it'll actually rev match to whatever you're doing so if you're running like 70 miles an hour down the road you hold that thing down it'll actually drop down to like 30 gear and then you put the hammer down and 
away you go. Now we can park this dry thing in your driveway no matter where you live, so call us at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your drive. All right, we're underneath the Mustang now, and man, it is cool under here. Unfortunately, there's a lot of covers that are hiding a lot of cool stuff. Like inside the exhaust, it's got that active uh, valve in there that you can, uh, it's got like four different settings, quiet to all the way to track mode. And then of course, you can see the two lines coming out of here. That's your diff cooler. It actually has a little pump that pumps the diff fluid all the way back to a cooler and cools it down, puts it back in there. So basically, you know, these cars are set up as a race car that you can drive on the road. You can see the rear suspension. It is independent suspension. Uh, that center section there, everything looking sweet. Um, of course, we've got braces going in every direction under here. Uh, we got the heat shielding here off the exhaust. Now, a lot of people point out they think these are dense. Uh, this is actually what it looks like from the factory. I mean, you can see it clean as a whistle under here. It looks brand new. Um, what else can I show you? Oh, we've got the uh, seven speed transmission here. This is a dual clutch um, manual transmission basically, but it shifts automatically. You've got one clutch does first, third, fifth, and seventh, and the other one does reverse, second, fourth, and sixth. You didn't think I was gonna get through that, did you? But it's super cool. You can either paddle shift it or it shifts automatically. Um, oh, one other thing I want to bring up. A lot of people ask about these scratch marks here on the frame. I do believe what happens with those is this is where it goes down the assembly line, whatever they've got that it sets on the assembly line. Because we've had quite a few of these Mustangs. I mean, they're coming and going quick. But um, every one of them have those marks on the frame. You can see that all this cover, all nice and neat. Um, now, when I was telling you about the... Uh, the front end here, these actually, these splitters come in the passenger seat. So see all these bolts? You gotta take all that shit apart and take, you gotta loosen all this up and it slides in. There's a bunch of bolts underneath this cover, then that cover goes on. I mean, it's a couple hours worth of work to put that together. So um, it's really cool that this one's already on. Uh, we got great looking carbon fiber wheels on here. And then you see this coating here. This is like a space age heat coating because those gigantic brakes will throw off some heat. You get this baby up on the uh, racetrack or if you drive it like you stole it. We got 305, 30, 20s up front and these are the Pilot Sport Cup 2s. Now on my car, I actually bought a little rubber thing that fits in here because the tires throw rocks up on here and just piss me off. But they make these little rubber, I think I paid 20 bucks for them. Uh, the rockers are nice and clean. You can see the floorboards here nice and clean. Out back, we got a little bit more rubber. These are 315, 30, 20s. Uh, again, the carbon fiber wheel that comes with the track pack deal. Um, then again, Brembo brakes back here too. And this, this little uh, mat, or, uh, caliper right here is your parking brake. Well, we're going to lower this thing down right now and look at that 760 horse under the hood. All right, under the hood here, we got the 5.2 supercharged 760 horse monster, man. Isn't it sweet? I love this car. Now, you can see that they're real proud of it because they have the mechanics sign the motor when they assemble it. Everything under here is nice and clean, looking sweet. It's got the stock air on it. Um, actually, I should say intake. Um, of course, power steering, power brakes. Um, I change the oil in mine um, by myself or I don't take it anywhere. There is a special filter that you need to use. Now, a lot of these oil change places will put a filter in that's not really for these cars. They make a special filter for the GT500s and the GT350s. Um, so make sure you get that. Now this rain tray comes off, so if you take it out for race day or if you happen to live someplace where it's really freaking hot, um, you just take out those torques all the way around and then that thing actually breathes, keeps it nice and cool under the hood. I mean, she's amazing, guys. I absolutely love this car, have had a blast driving them. So call us, 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this dream in your drive.